Hi everyone. Today I will be taking you through the demo of OpenERV Medical Healthcare Hospital Management System, a product by Pragmatic TechSoft. First, let's start with the configuration part. In configuration, we have a laboratory wherein various lab testing units are pre-configured in the system. We can create new type of lab tests. These lab tests serve as templates at the time of lab test. We have 17 pre-configured lab tests in the system. The next option is for diseases. 14,183 diseases are pre-configured in the system according to ICD-10 standards. We can create new diseases using create button or using new disease option. We have disease categories around 286 disease categories are pre-configured in the system. The next option is for medical procedures. 72,589 medical procedures are pre-configured in the system according to internationally accepted standards. The next is health centers. This option is used to maintain the hierarchy of the system. This is a hospital center form. Next move towards health center buildings. Each health center building is attached to a institution. The next is health center units. We have different health center units under one institute. The next is health center wards. The ward is configured for the building. Other information of the ward like the number of beds present, a private bathroom, whether internet access is present or not is also mentioned in the record. Next is health center beds. In this record we enter the bed type, ward, telephone number and the status of the bed. The next is hospital operating rooms. We can configure operating rooms for the buildings and the institute. The next is physician records. We can add the name of the physician, the institution to which the physician belongs to, the specialty and the ID of the physician. The next is medicament list. Here the various details of the medicaments are configured. We have 375 pre-configured medicaments. The next option is for dosage frequency. We have 21 dosage frequency records created. This mentions how many times per day the medicine will be given to the patient. The next is medical dose units. The next is medicament administration routes. Herein 45 pre-configured medicine administration routes are created. The medicament administration routes is the way in which the medicine will be given to the patient. For example, whether the medicine will be applied externally, whether it will be inhaled, 
whether it will be given directly in the arteries etc the next is medicament form medicament form is the form in which the medicine will be given to the patient for example whether it will be a cream or drops or a capsule or a biscuit etc we have 94 medicament forms pre configured in the system the next is medicament categories we have 172 pre configured medicament categories in the system the next option is for insurance companies we can create records for insurance companies entering their details like telephone number the website the email and other details the next is insurances in this the insurance details of the patient are entered like the type of insurance whether it's state labor union or private the insurance company the plan under which plan the patient is insured the membership starting date and the ending date is also mentioned the next is genetics around 4298 genetic risks that official symbols the official long names and the affected chromosomes are pre-configured in the system new records can be created using create button the next is miscellaneous information we have medical specialities in which various specialities of the doctor like anatomy, cardiology, embryology, anesthesiology etc are maintained. The next is occupations 653 different occupations are listed in the system. New additions can be made using create button the next is ethnic group around seven ethnic groups are pre-configured into system new additions can be made using create button the next option is for recreational drugs 27 different kind of recreational drugs their category the toxicity level the dependence level and the street names are pre-configured in the system new additions can be made using create button now let's move towards patient creation form this is a patient record in this the details of the patient like the blood type the ethnic group, the address, the marital status, etc. are maintained. We have diseases tab in which various diseases that the patient has suffered so far are maintained. The next is medication tab in which the medicines provided to the patient so far are maintained. We have appointments tab in which the appointment history of the patient is maintained. The next is lifestyle option in which lifestyle details of the patient are maintained like we have diet and exercise information, we have addictions information, the next is sexuality information of the patient and at last we have safety information. The next is lab tests in which the history of various lab tests done for the patient are maintained. The next is gynecology.
information we have gynecological information like menstrual history the menopause age and the menopausal age of the patient we have mammography history of the patient we have pap smear history of the patient and obstetrics details of the patient the next is surgeries here the history of various surgeries performed on the patient can be maintained the next is socio economic details of the patient we have general details of the patient like socio economic levels the education levels housing conditions the occupation of the patient we have infrastructure details like the whether the sanitary sewers are present or not is there a running water nearby do you have internet te television and telephone access at home or not the next is family options wherein the details of patient relationship with the family are maintained like whether the patient ha takes help from the family does he share time with family is family helpful in decision making etc this is how we create patient forms